Welcome to this module dedicated to XU photoelectric sensor technology. A photoelectric sensor is a piece of equipment used to detect the presence or absence of an object without contact using a light transmitter and a photoelectric receiver. They are easy to install and configure. They enable non-contact detection and do not wear out. Through those features, photo technology can be used everywhere. A photoelectric sensor is a proximity detector based on light beam emission and detection. The light beam transmitter, usually a light-emitting diode, emits a light beam. When an object goes through the beam, the beam is deviated. The light-sensitive receiver detects this deviation. In this example, the light-sensitive receiver detects the beam reflection. The photoelectric sensor makes the information of the presence or absence of object available for the automation system. Photoelectric sensors have a wide range of applications to detect presence or absence of objects, parts, people. They are commonly used in assembly lines, food and beverage processing, material handling, packaging, access control, mobile equipment. There are four detection modes, diffuse, background suppression, reflex, through beam. As already mentioned, the detection technology is based on the light beam emission and detection. The system has always two parts, the transmitter for light beam emission, the receiver for light beam detection. The light beam is emitted by the LED, light emitting diode. The lenses in front of the LED and the receiver focus the beam in order to increase the energy received by the phototransistor. Detection occurs when an object enters the transmitted light beam and, in so doing, affects the intensity of the light at the phototransistor, the photoelectric receiver. As the light intensity at the receiver increases, the output of the sensor changes state. It behaves like an electrical contact. The gain is the ratio between the received light energy and the necessary light energy to switch the product on. When the quantity of light is not enough, there is no detection. For a given application, a photoelectric sensor shall be adapted to the type of object to be detected. Whatever the size, the color, the shape of the object carried by this conveyor, it shall be detected. The photoelectric sensor shall also be adapted to the distance between it and the object to be detected. Whatever the distance between the sensor and the object carried, it shall be detected. But in this case, other objects outside the conveyors should not be detected. Not to mention that the photoelectric sensor shall be adapted to its environment. The environment light, for instance. Or the presence of dust. A part of the light energy goes back. The orientation of the ray depends on the surface. If it is shiny, plain, and smooth, the incident ray is returned in only one direction. It acts like a mirror. If it is matte, the incident ray is returned in all directions. One part of the light energy can be absorbed. The energy is transformed into heat, for instance. A black matte object absorbs more energy than a white one. Refraction and dispersion. If the object is transparent, a part of the remaining energy is transmitted with a different angle depending on the material. To sum up, in order to be detected, the object must reflect and diffuse enough light. That's why white objects could be easier to detect than gray or black ones. Opaque objects are easier to detect than the transparent ones. The object can be detected if it is within a zone delimited by the sensing distance, which varies with the type of object, the environment, and the characteristics of the sensor, and the blind zone, which varies from 0 to 10 millimeters according to the detection mode.
the object's shape can influence the direction where the beam is reflected. If the phototransistor does not receive enough energy, the object won't be detected. To be detected, the object shall reflect and diffuse enough energy to the photoelectric sensor. Regarding detection easiness, flat and concave surfaces are more favorable than convex surfaces. Environment conditions may impact the detection performance. Especially strong ambient light may blind the sensor and dust may reduce the light intensity.